come here to die, have you? You looking to die again? You amuse, but do not impress. You lack his conviction. Choose. He who traversed these caves some thirty years ago. Turning a deaf ear to our wails and wishes, he proceeded unfazed, eyes ever forward. Yet he proved powerless before the general, cast out in defeat. If even he could not succeed, I see no hope for you. <clears throat> that guy must have left quite an impression when he let it flat on his face. Clarice would have tried to stop you, you know. Just like he tried to stop me. All those years ago. How come? Because one aspiring to the role of King's Shield can stake his life for none but his liege. Not even for himself. Do you dare risk all for naught in return? His words stayed with me. <sighs> and he was right. I barely made it back with nothing to show for it. So you're gonna stop me? No, I won't. But I will warn you one last time of the danger you're about to face. Just like your father warned me. Once you set foot through that door, there's no turning back. And no one to help you if you fall. One false step and it may prove your last. I'll be fine. Maybe I'll come back with a souvenir. Just come back alive. Be safe, Gladio. There's a chill in the air. I can feel his presence. You better be ready for me. Good. 
your reliance on strength alone reveals your weakness in me. Countless disappointments have been around here. And so shall you. you. No. I didn't come here to die. I came here to prove to you I'm worthy.
Exactly the souvenir I had in mind. It took me a while, but I realized something. You're right. I am afraid. Uh, afraid of accepting the fact that maybe I'm not really cut out for the job I'm expected to do. But hey, at least I'm not walking away empty handed. I'd better get going. I may be all muscle and no metal. But I'm gonna keep protecting Noct, the only way I know how. Hmm. Spoken like a true shield of the king. Huh? Fear and doubt beget death alone. He who averts his gaze from his own faults cannot himself a true shield call. But you, having made peace with your inner self, have proven you are worthy. The Chosen King should be so fortunate as to have a man like yourself serving at his side. You mean... And with this glaive, I entrust my power to you. <clears throat> Where did you... Taken from the young man who impressed me with his strength of will. It was with this very blade he stole from me my arm. But... I can't accept this. If he still walks among the living, a man of his mettle will have doubtless transcended attachment to mere material possessions. <laughs> You're probably right. In that case, don't mind if I do. Now, hasten forth, with mind unclouded by doubt and will unmoved by fear. The last king of Lucis is ill fit to fight without his shield. Thanks again. You made it. Sure did. And so quickly. I'm impressed. Brought this back with me too. Figured you might get a kick out of it. <laughs> I wondered where I put that thing. <sighs> Keep it. <laughs> Makes for a better souvenir than that scar. You know, he mentioned he lost his arm in battle with a real hot-headed young guy back in the day. That's so. Whoever it was left a lasting impression on him. 
talked about how the guy had the strongest will he'd ever seen. It takes more than will to complete the trial. You need to wield your weapon with a primal finesse. If you fail to prove your might, you get cast out empty-handed. I don't know. He didn't seem to think the guy would let it bother him. He said the guy's too old to care about material things anymore. If he's still alive. <laughs> Gladio. Huh? I hope you feel more confident in light of your success today. Few men can lay claim to such an accomplishment. Not even Kor the Immortal. Yeah, but I didn't earn myself a badass nickname like he did. Still, I'm glad I went through with it. I can finally say I'm truly ready to fulfill my duty. Good. Well, I guess this shield better mosey on back to his king. Wouldn't want him to get scared without me. So, that's how you got it. What do you think? Very perpendicular. Really compliments the one you got when you saved Nock from that bully. Yeah. Only difference is, this time, I ended up taking a pretty bad beating, too. Uh, not unlike the licking the Marshal received back when he was a lad. Must have had a lot of guts to go up against Gilgamesh back then. <laughs> yeah. Dad said he used to be a real firecracker. The more you know. Hmm. If the Blade Master sequestered himself during the Founder King's reign, then he's haunted those halls for some two millennia. That's a long time. All those years waiting for the Chosen King to arise? You sure know how to take your sweet old time. What can I say? I'm worth the wait. Give me a break! And I as well. <sighs> Just because you got a shield to protect you now doesn't mean you get to slack off. But if you do, I'll be ready. Yeah. <laughs> 